Alrighty, everyone. Welcome back to Cyberpunk 2077. So, when we last left off, we were cleaning up the streets of Kabuki, this little district right here. And I ran around afterwards and did some of the NCPD crime things. Because those are not the most exciting ones in the world. I figure y'all wouldn't want to see this. But I got a phone call from Regina just as I was finishing up. And she wants us to do something. Agent Saboteur. Upload bads malware location make building H11 details bad guy in touch with me they like to share they like short nicknames and simple gigs so I'll spare you the fixer spiel and get right to the point you'll find bads malware attached to this message you have to download it just be careful it's hella dangerous and then upload it to the subnet in the H11 mega building piece of cake right sorry to burst your bubble but you'll have tigers on the prowl. Bad's plan is to attack some Arasaka subnet and use H11 as a smokescreen. Clever, right? Instead of leading them to, leading to them all traces of Bad's beach, breach will lead right back to the mega building. Oh, what the hell? I pressed the wrong button. Goodbye, brother. I'll make you my Oh, come on. I tried. <laughs> Hmm. 
I will... What? I thought they said it was better. Yeah, there we go. I'll use this Ajax. I just don't really care for the normal double barrel shotgun. And I would rather use the Advantage. Hey, it's blue. battery, slow rotor, med kit. Alrighty, that's a wrap on that one. revealed ah I like oh it's not even better but I got two G's I can live with that stuff all right time to scoot I can actually watch TV in this game I love that revolver. By the by, that shit is That's cool. Happy, which means I'm happy. Which means you get your eddies, and everyone's happy. Contract closed. Thanks, V. All right, now we need to. This is where we left off, Mr. Hands. Need to make contact with the Voodoo Boy's chief if you can swing it. All right, all right. Straight to heavy business. Hmm. Now, that'd be Maman Brigitte. Be tough getting a word into her. Uh, I was led to believe you could arrange anything. Ah! Now that sounded like my third wife every time she wanted a new purse. <laughs> Maman Brigitte? That sounds like a spooky cult alias. Ah, lips don't even had move. I've the pleasure of asking her personally, but it is what everybody calls her. Doubt the title has any real religious weight, though. Voodoo boys play so pretty down, fast right? and loose with their Haitian hmm? heritage. Really don't do any biz with them? Not with the chefs, chefins, priests, and whatnot. All got dirigible-sized egos. Won't talk to lowly me. But if you insist, I can ask around, try to set something up. I'll just need some details first. <sighs> Got something they want. Truly? Want to sell something to the VDBs? Trust me, they don't want it, have they don't need it. To do? They're isolated, insulated, they got their own contracts, tech, networks. But, have it your way. Okay, I'll see what I can do and get back to you. All right, pursue other leads. Um, 
Go do Ghost Town, shall we? Oh, I did the races on my personal character. And what I'm doing in my personal playthrough is I'm just doing side quests. I don't progress in the story until I do it here. So we all get to experience it for the first time. Personal quests playthrough is just to really scratch that cyberpunk itch when I really can't play this or record a video for y'all. But yeah, the races that you can do with Claire, the bartender from Afterlife, are so damn fun. It's almost like a death race without, like, mini guns on the hood of your car. Alright, let's go to Afterlife, talk to Rogue. Heads open, drag the bodies inside. I told you, dog. After How's things? Go in. Oh, you're nice. Hey, V. Claire, right? You come to talk about my offer? Yeah, let's talk street racing. Sure, but not here. It's mayhem. I'll be at my garage after my shift. Swing by. Nova, talk there. Nova. Have a good one. Wait, I still want to talk to you. Ah. Hey, lover boy. You're spilling. Yeah, you wrenched the whole bar. Just get your drunk clock home. No. This trouble? The net around me? You woke it. You know it. I lost everything. Let me be you. plain. Who's that? Again. Solve your own problems. Clean it up. Palmer. Go fuck yourself. Damn. Be careful who you bargain with. Need a fixer. Got something that can't wait. Let her in. Hmm. Not here. Not there. Who are you? Name's V. And what is it you want, V? All these years, it's really her. Fucking bro, just kicking it back on a couch at the afterlife. Don't mess with her, she's got MRIs. See right through you. Give her the truth. MRIs? The girl. What was her gripe? Why don't you ask her? Might still be around, sniveling in a corner. That's nice. Need your services. Gotta track a guy down. Mm-hmm. Anders Hellman. Hotshot engineer, worked for Arasaka. Millisec. Anders Hellman. Pinpoint him for me? <laughs> Thanks. Jump in too soon. First, my help's got a price. Second and third, Dexter Deshawn, Jackie Wells, Tiba. Multiple bells ringing, B. Left a lot of bodies behind. Death walks in your wake. Chalk that up to bad luck? There's the bitch I know. Ask her about Sokka Tower. How they shot me up right in front of her. Wanna go through obits? Really? Fine. Johnny Silverhand. Zeroed inside our Sokka Tower. Before your very eyes. Got more if you want. Or we could just talk. Got nads on you, girl. <laughs> Don't like that on every woman, but they seem to suit you. Anyways, feelings be damned, I've always said. This is pure biz. You need my help, so get those eddies ready. Mm-hmm. See? Uh-huh. And if I don't have the scratch, it's fuck off and have a nice day. No. More like come back when you do. Them's the breaks. <laughs> mm -hmm. Then, see ya. Soon. Oh, I got it. I was just curious. Should be enough. Damn, mm -hmm. 15 G's. Come back tomorrow. We'll talk. Oh, 
Nice talk to her. Yeah. Oh, evident. Uh, yeah. Want to memorialize a friend? Chula mine earned a spot on the menu here. A chulo bowl with the bun? Yeah. Well, sorry to hear. Remember his drink? The recipe? Vodka on the rocks, lime juice, and ginger beer. Ugh. Splash of love. That's right. In the drink's name. A Jackie Wells. Right. Well, the first Jackie Wells is on me. Thanks, Claire. No problem. Just holler if you need anything. Uh, I wish I could actually order the drink. Here to see Rogue, expecting me. Hey Rogue, I'm back. What about Hellman? Two, please. Make some room. Oh, Sit down. He, he shaved his seat oh, for me. Him. Don't see that often. Determination like yours. Must really need this guy. Matter of life and death. <laughs> Haven't heard that for a while either. Bottle stays. Go ahead. Enjoy. To your health. To yours, kid. Gonna need it. Thanks, Nix. Queen of the afterlife. Who would have thunk? Got a shard for you. Intel. Interesting stuff. Think she'll help? The rogue I remember was one cold-ass bitch. But she usually went with her gut. Something tells me she thinks you'd check out. Let's see what you got. Your helmet's not on any payroll, not officially anyway. But he does pop up in GNT's confidential stacks. It's a Kang Tao subsidiary, Chinese Corp. Kang Tao's been using them as a fig leaf for years. They're masked for more sensitive operations. All that clear? Must be prepping him for a transfer. How would you know? Chinese Corpo playbook's an open one to me. This looks like the old vanishing pigeon. Decrypted map of upcoming Kang Tao convoy routes. Think Hellman might be in one of them? Thing is, which one? Take a look at the specs on this one. A lone AV, no ground support, no linked cargo manifests either. Weird. Sure, Kang Tao sometimes transports stuff unregistered if they want to push it under the table, but catch the load on this AV. Already approved in the system, but too low. So definitely no cargo on board. Huh. But mm. there's a passenger list. Kang Tao security detail plus one VIP. Transfer from Chan T. Our boy Hellman. That was the good news. <laughs> there it is. Data's all confidential. You just snap your fingers and it falls in your lap. I know where to look, and I know whose head to put in a vice. Also, hate wasting time, especially answering stupid questions. So what's the bad news? Bad news is the extraction site. Look, Night City airspace. All this. Uh-huh. No way to jack the transport without the NCPD picking up on it. And here, we're too close to Kang Tao. We even give that AV a dirty look, their backup hustle will be on us. But, right here's Jackson Plains. Narrow corridor, just outside the city, and just out of Kang Tao's reach. Guess it's your lucky day. A dead zone. I'll grab him there. Gonna need a native to the area. Someone who'll set up the op, cobble together the gear. Even tracking that AV will be a bitch. Familiar with the type. Saw legacy models flying around during the war. 
They're mammoth, but they're quick. Plus, they pack next-gen defenses. Can't take pot shots at it, not even with serious firepower. Just won't work. It's not about firepower. There are ways, and people who know them. Or who can at least improvise on a theme. So a native. Know any hick mercs? Just one. Pan Am Palmer. Oh, the girl. She can't count on her clan anymore, but she's a true nomad. She knows those lands. And she will help you. Won't have a choice. Won't have a choice? Does not sound enticing. Not for her, not for me. Enticing comes at a price you can't possibly afford. Can't possibly <laughs> afford to blow this chance at Nabin Hellman. Your operation, your call. Got a bad feeling, V. Strange. The nomads give the city and city folk a wide berth. Varies by clan, by the connections they have, the depth of shit they're in. But you're right. Alda Caldos are rarely willing to do biz with the city. Pan Am's got a different take? Yep, on everything, it seems. Hmm. Why is Pan Am gotta help me? I sense a catch. Pretty big one. Occasionally, Pan Am moves merch for me. Last job? Well, wasn't a good day for her. She ran into a hitch. Complete bust, actually. Lost the goods and her ride. Pan Am will do anything to get the load back. Means her dignity. I know her. Okay. Guess I can try to help her, but if we don't know where to look, I mean... We do. I do. You know, but wouldn't tell Pan Am. Aim to play cat and mouse with me, too? My aim is to know an opportunity when I see one, and then to seize it. Say I told her everything. What do you think she'd have done? Grabbed her iron and gone on the warpath, that's what. Not hard to see how that could end it. And there's nothing I hate more than losing good people to plain stupidity. <laughs> I'm her only yeah. chance, and she's my only chance. Two pawns on Rogue's board. You're quick. For a pawn. No, V. Fine, let me hear what you know. Rocky Ridge, ghost town just outside <coughs> Night City. Pan Am knows where. You'll go there, get the merch back. Wheels too. Naturally, you'll call her first. Sending you her deeds. Ah, oh, finally. All clear. Let's get out of here. Thanks. Good luck. Ooh. Anything? Hang on just a little longer, too. Ripper's on the way. Oh, fuck. Oh, rotten luck. Oh, man. Bleeding. Hey, Bleeding all, Bleed all over the damn pool table. Uh, fuck. Say something, Shen. Anything. Are those real women? Come. Coming, dog. You'll be here in five minutes flat or... Fuck! Let's give this chick a call. Oh. I'm gonna puke. Hello? This Pan Am? V here. V who? V where? How did you even get this number? From someone at the afterlife. Mm hmm. So, what is it you want? Actually, wanted to talk about what you want. Is that so? The merch you lost, and your ride. You want him back? Let's talk. Hmm. That's so. Ah, rogue and confidentiality. I might have known. The rail freight yard on Benita Street. The one hugging the city line. We'll meet there. See ya. Alrighty, let's go do this little mission for Pan Am while we are waiting on that call from Mr. Hands. Now he better hurry up with that intel on the Voodoo Boys or he's gonna have my hands to catch. Oh. Oh! Close. Two and a half kilometers. Should be able to make it. Pretty good time. Yeah, should be able to make a pretty good time on this bike. 
getting better. I'm getting better. But gotta, oh, gotta. Uh oh. Oh, motorcycle. So where is this at exactly? Oh, it's just right over here, straight shot. Oh my god. They call got something for me? Captain. Well, it's and like I said. You, whatever you're peddling. See no the introductions are just necessary. Not in the market. Already took care but of them. They have another task that needs to do. So I volunteer. I take care of. Do it well eat, and you'll get your audience sleep, with Brigitte. And breathe, Biz. Remember that. Aye, aye, Captain. While we're at it. You need fresh wheels, bikes? I got it all. Real good prices. So hit me up anytime. You hear? Jesus. Okay, so who do I talk to and how? Hit the chapel on Sloan. Look for the altar inside. Someone will touch you, nod to you. Something spooky. <laughs> Got it, thanks. Alright, we'll do map down plan. We'll do that later. We're already here with Pan Am, so we'll do this. Hey! Hey. Hey. Pan Am? So you're V. Where's my car? Why does it matter? What's wrong with this one? It's borrowed. It's not mine. I asked where my car is. We can help each other. Rogue said so. I might have guessed. All right. Tell me all you know. Fail, and you can run back and tell Rogue to fuck right off. Hey, come on. Calm down. Don't tell me what to do. Fine. Know where to find the cargo and your car, but you go alone, you won't get him back. And you could lose something else besides. So let's figure something out. What do you want? <coughs> One guy I gotta talk to. A corpo traveling by corp convoy. No, I don't do abductions. Besides, you'd need many more bodies and heaps of gear to take a convoy. It's just one AV. Plan route will take it over Jackson Plains. Fuck. In return, info on your cargo. Help in getting back what's yours. They got a deal? I don't know. I... Shit! All right, deal. But if you want your thing done, we'll need to get my Thornton back first. So where is it? Thought this was mostly about the merch. Fuck the merch. With that ride, I can take any transport job in town. Without it, only thing I can move is pizza. Maybe. Hm. Cars in Rocky Ridge. You're supposed to know where that is. Cars there, goods are there. Nash, you dirty eating bastard. I will strangle you. Nash a chum of yours? He hang you out to dry? Do not call him that. 
fine. Partner. Former. If ever. The shift tricked me. Straight nipped my truck and the merch. Probably now aims to sell it off in Rocky Ridge. Is he ever going to be fucking disappointed? Rocky Ridge. Let's go. Uh, hang on. I, I, I should think this through. Fuck. Yes. We'll need backup. We have one brief stop to make on the way. Want to tell me where? Give me a sec. I should call the client. Convince them to leave the bastard hanging. Going ahead with the deal behind Rogue's back. Brave, I guess. Or fucking dumber than a drum. Buzz, hey. Nash is gonna pass you the merch in Rocky Ridge. The thing is, the motherfucker screwed me over. Boss, I will take care of it. I just need you to give me a chance. Boss, come on. How many times have I moved things for you? And how many times have I failed? You have my word. After dark? Okay. No, don't call off the meat. Just don't show up. I'll take care of everything. Do you even have to ask? Of course I will. Thanks, boss. You won't regret this. Okay. I have bought us some time. Gave that meathead your word and he took it? Is that surprising? It's called having a reputation. <laughs> you should try getting one of your own. Damn. Who the hell's boss? Won't cause us any Street grief, creds at I 19. I got a boss little Boss is a stand-up guy. Sixth Street. You drive for gang goons. Is that not allowed? Street punks need things moved. I need money like anyone else. Alright. So, where to now? The Aldecaldo camp. I need to see some of the old clan. Don't seem too excited. That's not your concern. I still have friends there. Rogue mentioned your friends. Said you guys stopped seeing eye to eye. Well, since Rogue said so, it must be true. It isn't? You mean to irritate me. Okay, then. It was just a hiccup. They're still family. So it's complicated. You might say so. Yes. Any chance they might help us? In Rocky Ridge? That is the plan. Good, let's roll. Get in. Let's roll along some country roads. Take me home to the place. I nice belong. ride. Lots of space. Practical. Where's Say no more. Please. How far is the camp? Just past the city line. We'll jump on the nine and head east. How the hell did you land in this mess? I liked the color. The air freshener and booster seat came extra. You know I don't mean the car. What am I supposed to tell you? That I'm not about to let my partner rob me and get away with it? That my fixer made me look like a goddamn fool? What about you? Why do you need that clown from the AV? This particular clown's got intel I need. And I'm running out of time to get it. So why didn't she tell me she knew about Nash? Rogue, do better not to worry what her agenda might be. God damn, I can't stand the bitch. Know what? Screw Rogue. Can't see why you even care. Because I need the money. Don't let her push you around. She's not the only fixer in town. Yet you're only here because she sent you. But I'm not the one bitching about her. You don't know her. Not at all. Did she tell you she was the one to bring me and Nash together? Did she tell you it slipped her mind to mention Nash was Raffin Shiv? Wait, Nash is Raffin? Yes. He runs with the Wraiths, the largest Raffin group in the area. You know about them, right? Mm-hmm. Nomads tossed out of clans. Yes, mostly. Nomads don't banish their own without a reason. So think murderers, rapists, freaks. They gather in teams. Sometimes form actual gangs. Most of them are wanted and have warrants on their heads. Shit. And that bitch had me working with scum like that. Might not have known that side of him. So 
Don't make me laugh. A fixer of her standing knows. And Rogue probably knows we're talking about her right now. Nash and I had a role to play in her game. Her plan. That's it. Rogue's a frigid old bitch. That's the truth. Hmm. <laughs> You're not wrong there. How far is this camp of yours? Skip the ride. Whoa! I was about to run her over. Well, would you look what the cat dragged in? Is that a ghost or is it just my hangover? Fuck you too. Mm hmm. And who's this? My babysitter. V, this is Scorpion. Mitch. Two old friends. Not a babysitter. Partner in crime. Mm hmm. What brings you to these parts, city girl? The big city got too small for her. Do you have any idea how angry the old man's gonna be when he sees you here? I've just come by for a spell. Saul needn't know a thing. Need your help. With what? What's this about? Raffin screwed Pan Am. Plan is to show him that was a bad idea. How bad did they get you? Bad enough to make me sit quietly through all your bullshit. You know, we would do anything for you, sister. But now? Now's hard. Seriously? You won't help? Uh, well, the old man told us to sit tight and get those generators back up after the batteries went kaput. Generators? You won't help because of some goddamn generators? Is this another joke? Really could use your help. Not this time. We're needed here. Fuck. I don't believe this. So you'll stay put because Saul told you to. You couldn't care less about me. Pan Am. This isn't about Saul. It's about the clan. You know that. Listen, we can't leave camp. No chance. But but Saul never said a thing about gear. Got a sick arm, dude. Okay. Well, we I'll need that prosthetics. rifle of yours. And some of my own stuff. Take whatever you want. And take care of yourself out there. Yeah. Thanks, guys. I'll grab the gear, then be out of your hair. Yeah. Looks like you're stuck with me. Just a little disappointed we can't mm -hmm. get prosthetics. I know we can get, like, gorilla arms and stuff, but... I don't know. Maybe a little, Not yes. the same. What if I want a robot legs? Are you staying a while? No, I'll be going again soon. We'll talk next time. Hey, Pan Am. Hey, Pan Am. Have you brought someone new? Does Saul know? Not your concern, friend. Help me with this. What's inside? A few odds and ends that should be useful. Take it. All right, that's everything. Let's go. Did you figure Militech. out the differences with Saul? Will you come back? Yeah, just ignore that dude. <laughs> You'll stop by later, right, honey? Next time, Ellie. I promise. Sprint over there. So, I'm off. Yeah, yeah, Put go it in on, the trunk. go already. Call us sometime. Keep an eye on her, V. Hey, I was trying to scan that. We can go. Hop in. Mitch and Scorpion seem good souls. The best friends a girl could ask for. I'd stay in the camp too if I were in their shoes. Fuck Saul and his generators, of course. Yet the clan comes first. 
but I'm not part of it anymore. Still treated you like you're one of them. They care about you. Mm hmm Do you have anyone you would call close? Not right now, no. Could just be a matter of time, though. <laughs> okay. What? Were those two in the army? Scorp and Mitch? Yeah. Panzer boys. They were on contract during the last war. Panzer boys? Flew those huge transporters? Scorpion piloted. Mitch ran security. They both got some kick-ass combat implants and a stack of really fucked up nightmares. Seems you got a real problem with authority. What? Rogue? Saul? Your leader? Their leader. Seemed in a hurry to delta the hell out of there. Let's just say Saul wouldn't have been happy to see me. What happened? The reason we came to California was because he promised to change for the Alda Caldos. He claimed we would turn over a new leaf. But you saw it. We got a handful of tents on a heap of sand. A hell of a promised land. I wanted something different. Better. Saul's a damned coward. He'll be the end of the clan, I'm certain. So, Rocky Ridge. Empty, dusty hole in the middle of bumfuck nowhere, I heard. Natives either moved to Night City or just got the hell out. Then you know almost all there is to know. The whole area was waiting on a new interstate extension. It was supposed to breathe new life into the town. It didn't happen, of course. How many ghost towns you think are there? Hundreds? Countrywide? Thousands. I drove down I-80 the crazy. other day. All you have to do is pull over after sundown. It's quiet then. And you hear it. What's that? The wind whistling through boarded up windows. Tumbleweeds scratching across dry, sandy tracks. That's how towns die. Not with a bang, but with whispers and whimpers. Hmm. Pan Am! Oh. <laughs> What do we do? We get ready to greet the Raffins, and we have little time for that. We'll need to improvise. We should scout first, to look for anything that might be useful. Down Rocky Ridge could be any debtor. Everything's down. Works here. Well, have you found anything? No dice. Nothing's up. All cut off. Well, we'll make it work. The Raffins will roll in after dusk. We will have a surprise ready for them. We just need to get some power flowing. Let's check the substation. Okay. Okay. But there's no juice on them. Not to worry. Come down. I know how to surprise the bastards. <sighs> right. So, the intersection is powered from that transformer substation, right? The switch gear on the roof. We'll flip the switch there and everything will light up like Christmas. Understood? Fine idea. Let's get us some power. I'll look around for access points. Great. They're likely to show up in numbers. We can't know how many. We need to outfox them, then get to my car somehow. Relax. Got a few ideas. I'll try to play a little game with them at the intersection. Hell yes. Perfect. As soon as they see the lights, they'll have to check who, why, and how. Nova. Yep. First, we start up the control terminal below. The gear on the roof is a hunk of junk without it. Come on, we'll give it a boost from the car battery. That should do the trick. Wait for me by the substation. I'll bring the car around. Alrighty. Yeah.
The panel looks to be in good shape. I'll make a bypass circuit to the power supply. That should do it. We'll just have to get it up and running. Grab the jumper cables from the trunk. We'll boost it from the car battery. We're gonna power most of a town with jumper cables from a car battery. Must the be cable a connected. crazy ass battery. Give me a moment. I need to hook everything up here. And done. Now the black rattler. There she goes. Thought the old jalopy served us well. Okay, I've got voltage. Old Start the jalopy. terminal inside. And once the power is on in the building, get on that roof. You got it. I'll set up on the tower. We'll have the whole intersection on a platter. You flip the breakers when I give you the signal to do so, understood? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Oh. Just one point lacking. <laughs> oh shit, how the hell am I supposed to get in there? Just break the glass and dive in. Oh, we That's can. not as if someone will send you a bill. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> All righty. Let's get back over there. <laughs> I hear you, dog. I'll let you out in a minute. That was crazy. Which gear's got power? Prime. We'll have some fun at the intersection. Let's get into position. <laughs> All right, one second. All righty, boys. Sorry about that. Sorry for the jump cut. I had to give my dogs their flea medicine and let them outside. Man, you want to talk about little assholes feeding flea medicine to them? Just want to spit it out and fucking bite the hell out of my fingers. Now we wait. Oh well. Take out the frustrations on Remember, these guys. As soon as we see them, you give us power. Raffins will come from where? Any idea? The northeast, I wager. From the freeway that was never finished. Got it. Cover me, just in case. Of course. They're rolling in. In my thorn. You see her? Really, really hard to miss. Let's take them by surprise. Let's try to do this quietly. If anything happens, I'll start picking them off. Sound good? Sounds great. Is that her truck? That's a big hoss. Compensator. Where's this son of a bitch boy? You, wait for him here. Get good and ready. The show starts now. Let there be light. Let's throw a sight on this bad boy real quick. I got this, but I want something. A little more long range. The car shop. The driver has it. Look for the girl with the ball on. Say goodbye! Fuck. Cover it. We have to pick all of them up now. Carry low. No fucking mercy! Healing. 
about to get down and dirty. Uh oh, poison. Right through him. Yeah, you have to sit right there. I'm just gonna keep shooting. Oh, there's a cherry on top. Let's pack it in. No survivors. Now with these murders and rapists and thieves. We got a survivor. At least we had a survivor. Well, Pan Am, that was pretty fun. Mm -hmm. Move. I'll take the wheel. I want to drive. There. Couldn't wait another minute, could you? isn't she dreamy indeed no surprise you wanted her back she completes me see managed just fine without Mitch and Scorpion listen V it's not over yet it's not you got the cargo you got your car I did not get Nash who was not in Rocky Ridge the fucker didn't show Pan Am listen I have a plan and I don't care the car and the merch, that's what we were after. We got them. Six Street away word and listen to me, for fuck's sake. I know where their little hidey hole is. We'll take the old unfinished freeway nearby. They will not be expecting us. I'm sure of it. Ugh, all right. So where's this hideout? A hop and skip away. Doesn't really tell me where it's at. Thanks, v. What Nash did. I placed my trust in him. He was the first person I worked with after leaving the Alda Caldos. After I came to Night City. And I granted him my trust. I get it. Know how you feel. Had someone betray me just like that once. And did you make them pay? Never got the chance. Someone else got to them first. But if they had it, would you have done it? In a fucking heartbeat, dude. No doubt. Without skipping a beat. Let's get this over with. Oh, that was just a hop and a skip away. Are you ready? Let's get him. Truck's not as loud as I was expecting. She's fine. 
Oh my god. Shut your fucking mouth! Christ. Oh, got some legendary rocks. Don't bleed! Let's get him. Oh, they got reinforcements coming in other cars. Power they use. Get ready to move in. It did. Hell yeah! Quite the fireworks show. Boom! Got him. Two seventy six, Jesus. All right, let's get our gat back out on this one. Now, oh shit, I need to take off the scope. Equip. Put you on there. Renders it non-lethal. That's lame. Oh, and look, the scope I got even matches. Let's have a quick look-see around here. Kill any survivors. They don't deserve to live. Char grenade. Biohaz. Got some yums. Aldicados, Pan Am, Palmer. Thirteen hundred. Aminos. Recon grenade. I mean, you get so many damn grenades in this game. X 
executing these guys. Do, do, do. What the hell? Stay down. Frag grenade. Survivor. Let's see what we got here. Ah, oh, just grenades. I mean, that's cool, I guess, but not what I would have wanted. Hello, Rogue. Pan Am. What did you say again? Solve your own problems? Clean up your shit? Nash is dead. <laughs> Take a look at our gear. 15. Titanium BD wreath. No, don't want a little hat like that. Too shabby. Gonna be getting a lot of components. Eh, fuck it. Don't need it. <clears throat> Look at that, we got two iconic weapons equipped. Lunch. And the Sixth Street merch. Nash can't deliver it anymore. But if you ask nicely, I might be able to help you. Help me? I take my cut up front, honey. But I guess I'm touched. Ooh. I was actually wondering if you wouldn't forget about Biz while you were up chasing down a vendetta. Fuck. <laughs> I mean, she showed you. Pan Am. Looks like we got a jack in slot over here. Let's make some monies. One C nine. BD shit. Oh well. Just wasn't meant to be. Old Edge Runner, hey, another one. Let's see, do they look different at all? No, it's the same one. I got one of these at Old Edge Runner jackets on my other character and it doesn't say Night City on the back. I guess that's just the female one. This one says 6th Street Gang, which is kind of dumb. Oh well. Alright, let's have a word with Pan Am. This thing with Rogue. Let it go, maybe? Why should I? Because she's not worth another goddamn minute of your time. Let's go. What bitter cold bitch that broke. Think she might have lost the plot. You mean to say she used to be sweet and alluring? Huh. <laughs> Never that. But she's no stranger to the other end of the stick. Think she might need a nice strong shock. I can imagine, Johnny boy. 
Hey, boss. Got your cargo. No, no fast ones. Come on, let's meet. Sunset Ooh. Motel. I know you're not kidding. I'm certain to be there. Okay, I arranged our meeting. Let's do the deal and start working on Hellman. Agreed? Sixth Street not likely to pull anything? I've driven for them before. Never had them do anything strange. I'm hoping they know what's good for business. Sunset Motel? What's that? A safe spot. It's not far from here. Should be fun. Let's roll. They're here. Let me do the talking. Sensing trouble? No. At least I don't think so. All right. Hey, boss. Panna! How's Nash? Didn't seem to be answering his phone. Don't call him anymore. There's no need. <laughs> you got balls, girl. What's this? <coughs> A bonus of some sort? We work together. Hmm. Change tunes like you change clothes, girl. There. First class merch. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. So, everything's in order? Check your account. Should be pretty plush in a couple minutes. It's been a pleasure. But I believe Rogue's the one who is to pay me. You're all right. Think you earned a tip. Let's roll. That went well. Come on. Let's get a drink. Let's. Raffin's wiped. Six streets pleased. Pretty good day for Pan Am Palmer. Nash is dead. Congrats. Wonder what you were hoping to get out of that, because I don't think it was just a matter of wounded egos. Even wounded egos wouldn't do something that gonk. Hmm. What do you mean? The day's not over yet. You still have a chance to piss me off. Yeah. I'm all right, Rogue. Don't Hello, worry Doc. about me. Hey, new biz or new friends back there? Take a wild guess. Is everything good with you? Do those bozos come around again? Raffins? Nah, it's been quiet. They'll be back, sure enough. But this place has seen worse. What can I get you? Brosif. Two of them. So that package for Street, what was it? You didn't peek? Valoperidol. Drugs for the cyber psychos in our midst. They trading them? Yes. They have deals. With black clinics, rippers. Well, here's to that thorn of yours. Thanks for everything, partner. Another one over here. Sound like there was still some in there. Don't be wasteful, Pan Am. Thanks, Noah. Cheers. Let me know if you need anything else. The Raffins. 
We done with them? Oh no. The shiver cockroaches. One's never rid of them. But it should be quiet for a time. They'll need to gather their wits and dust themselves off. The Alta Caldos. Think you'll ever go back? I mean, not right now, but... Someday. I don't rightly know. On the one hand, I don't have anyone outside the clan. Shit, I don't really know any other life. But on the other? Got me. Without my clan, who am I? What would I become if I stayed in Night City? Could you start over again? That's what I did. Mm-hmm. For now, I only seem to be really good at burning bridges. Talking about Rogue. No. But thanks for reminding me. V. Do you think I can make a fresh start with her, too? She seems to better at ease on the right people. You'll work it out. All right. Time we look to my needs. What's the plan for Hellman? I've come up with a plan. A first draft. But I need to sleep on it. Work it out. Then we can talk about the details. I think it's best to rent rooms here. Just to stay in the area. We'll get to work around midnight. It'll help keep us out of sight. Agreed? Hmm. Maybe just one room? Maybe only one room? Mm-hmm. Noah has two twin beds in every room. We'll save some money. <laughs> Not quite what I had in mind. I know. Just glad to have met you, so I thought... Don't worry about it. I'm glad we met, too. That was a damn tough day. But still, we pulled through. And we'll do it again tomorrow. I like to hear that. Are we all right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. No, I will need a room. Twin beds. Just for tonight. I'll go catch a few wings. Gotta drink some water after drinking beer. That's only healthy. Shut me down. My name is Dakota. <coughs> if you're looking for jobs out here, you will find them with me. Name's V. Thanks for the intel. Things flow differently out here. Keep your head on, city kid. For you, sister. Oh, God, no. Well, guys, we're coming up on that hour. Um, we are gonna call it here. So, when we come back, we will get our job with Pan Am rolling. And we'll get underway with that. So, just to let y'all know, tomorrow is Saturday, yeah. And we'll be doing our live stream then <clears throat> for Cyberpunk. And I'm thinking we'll do the mission for Pan Am. And then probably do the, um, the mission where we contact the Voodoo Boys. But for the most part with the live stream, I want to uh, do a lot more side jobs, build up our rep, monies, 
recommend the level as, as much as I can. So, with that being said, I hope y'all enjoyed this episode of Cyberpunk 2077. And if you did, please like and subscribe. And I will see y'all next time. Take it easy. Bye.